obsessed much they can't get enough of you they can't stop talking about you talking bad about you they can't stop studying you morning noon and night 24-7, 365 and a quarter days a year. <laughs> they are all about you, you, you. My goodness. It's an obsession. There they are studying you. But will they ever graduate? They will never graduate from your college, from your school, from your university. They are so obsessed. They won't give you a break. You are too amazing. You are too blessed as far as they are concerned. Why is it that you are winning? Why is it that you are rising? Why is it that the light is shining on you? There they are, all jealous all envious they are so jealous so envious it is eating them alive it is destroying them it is killing them they want to take your place they want to be you no matter how they try it ain't working oh my goodness why are they so obsessed with you many of these people they are praying or they are hoping for that day when you fail, when you lose. That is what they have been hoping for. That is their greatest wish. That is what they need for them to be happy as the bird or the birds sing. Imagine that. That is what they want. Because you have surpassed them. You are doing better than them. You are happier than them. You are advancing and you are further ahead than them. They have not even started on this advancing path. <laughs> a lot of these people, they knew you a long time ago, a long time now, for years. Some for months, but some for years. Some of them knew you. When the two of you were little, you attended the same school, and there you are, looking all happy, all positive. They are there dwelling in negativity. Why is it that things are working out for you and nothing is working out for them? They are externalizing their power. They are blaming blaming it on you somebody wrote a song it said blame it on the rain <laughs> they are blaming it on you instead of realizing that they are responsible for where they are they are blaming somebody outside of them they are blaming you they chose you would you believe it how dare her be so blessed how dare him be so amazing how come you're winning so they will start to hate on you they need you to be down there so that they can feel happy they are waiting for that day you know how life is it's about hills it's about peaks it's about valleys one day you're doing well another day it's not so good in the grand scheme of things you're doing well you're always winning from broader perspective you're always winning but there are days when it's not so smooth sailing rough days the seas are rough tough days you're not feeling so good tough days you're not winning like you normally do you have a big a big loss that is the day they've been waiting for and there they are these people when things do not work out for you there they are there they will be laughing mocking woo, celebrating 
Hmm? It seems like you're not doing well, but what they don't understand is that you're only in that valley temporarily. You are going back up. You're losing in the short term, but you are really winning. You are learning what works and what doesn't. Your failures are temporary. Your defeat is temporary. You are learning so that you can climb back up. You never lose. They will be there laughing, but it is never about the first laugh. It is about the last laugh. So they are obsessed with you, obsessed, thinking that if you lose, they will win. Thinking that that if they destroy your building they will have the biggest building in town right now if they destroy everybody else's building it will appear that they will have the biggest building and they will be fine they don't want to construct the biggest building so that everybody sees wow they want to cheat their way to victory but it doesn't work that way they want to be running a race running but they're driving <laughs> it doesn't work that that way they're on a motorcycle it doesn't work that way they want to cheat their way it doesn't work that way i said they are obsessed with you they are blaming you for their lack of advancement they are blaming you but that is what they've chosen they don't want the best for others they don't want the best for you. How can they ever have the best in their life? There they are wishing that you fail. How can they expect to win? They are wishing the worst for you. So they get more of that in their life as the breeze blows. And whoo, it's beautiful. The sun is shining. The breeze is blowing. The birds are singing. Yes, whoo. Perfect timing birds. Just when I was about to announce y'all. <laughs> we heard the birds. They are obsessed. But will they ever get anything out of it that is good? No. They are studying you. But will they ever graduate? No. Will they ever get a degree? No. So they are wasting their time. Instead of being obsessed with you, they should be all about themselves. Instead of competing with you, they should be competing with themselves. They would have been better off. They would have been trying to be better today than they were yesterday. That is the type of person you are. You're trying to be better each day. You're trying to outdo yourself. Hmm? And if somebody is doing better than you, that is good. You clap for them. You celebrate. You're happy. Because it inspires you. You know that if they can do well, if anybody who looks like you, or even if they don't look like you, can do well, so can you. But not these people over there. They are obsessed with you. And it's keeping them back. They should have been inspired by you. You're trying. You're putting in the work. You're advancing. You're living that advancing life. You're working on yourself, your personal development. You're trying to be a, a better person. You're doing good. You're giving to others. You're providing value. You're being a light on the planet. You are a light bearer. You're not about hurting others. You are an empath. You care about others. You want the best for others. They should have been inspired by that. They should have showed you some love as opposed to all of this obsession, some appreciation. They should have been seeing your worth and they would have been better off. They would have been better off. It would have worked in their favor and they would have been fine today. The two of you could have been holding hands. There they are all obsessed with you, waiting for an opportunity. Because you're so powerful, 
because you're so blessed because you're so anointed <laughs> because you're so chosen because you answered the call they can answer the call too they can put themselves in a position to get that call in the first place hmm? they're blaming you for where they are they need to take responsibility take responsibility and blame themselves these people they won't give you a break won't give you a break because they've realized by now that they only get attention when they talk about you if they talked about themselves nobody would listen they've tried to talk about themselves nobody listened so they have to talk about you so that your audience could come to them that is what they're trying <laughs> because you're so interesting they're not interesting they're not doing anything worthwhile they need to talk about you so that they can get a following a lot of them they are there on Facebook they are there on Instagram they're desperate for likes they're desperate for comments they're desperate for views desperate 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 that is how they can find some validation if nobody likes their post they feel like they're nothing they feel worthless so they have to talk about you they're looking for that validation they need to DM somebody but it has to be about you because if it is about them that person wouldn't be interested they're desperate for outside validation and that is why they have to talk about the great one that you are the amazing one that you are if you were nothing they would not have been talking about you but you're a star a superstar you are that big celebrity you are that real celebrity you're amazing and they have to talk about you people don't talk about stuff if you're not big they won't talk about you who are they talking about on this planet all of the big celebrities all of the rich people of the all of the big winners you're in that category and you're even in a higher ca category how about that you're the advancing man <laughs> you're the advancing woman hmm? have to talk about you obsessed with you because your light is shining so brightly as we hear and the light is shining brightly in nature they have to talk about you obsessed 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 with you they won't leave you alone because you believe in yourself because you recognize how great you are because you are not putting yourself down because you do not see yourself as a nobody who are you that is what they're thinking to believe in yourself so much who do you think you are as the breeze blows they want you to feel small you're feeling great as you're one with god one with source one with the most high hmm? one with infinite intelligence you know your power you know your greatness how dare you know your greatness how dare you feel huge feel great feel amazing how dare you you need to feel like a nobody you need to feel small that is what they want they realize you're standing tall they realize that you're brave you're positive mm? you're vibrationally aligned to greatness your vibration is high you're vibrating at that high frequency as the breeze blows let the breeze blow let the wind blow the power of nature nature in all its splendor it's alive out there and you are alive you are with me on a vibrational level you are here with me hmm? it's just that you're not here in the physical but you are here with me <laughs> how about that hmm? 
How dare you? And that is why they are so obsessed. It's affecting them. It's killing them. It's destroying them. Because they are against your greatness. They are against the fact that you're super powerful. They are against the fact that you feel amazing. So, they end up feeling low. They end up feeling like nothing because they are against it. They are saying to the universe, don't give me that in my life. Hmm? If you can't beat them, join them. They need to join. Because by now they should have realized that they cannot beat you. For them to be able to join you, they must change their life. They must be a better person. They must not be the haters that they are. They must not be the agents of darkness that they are. They must be more positive. They must be more empathetic. They must be more real, more genuine. They must be part of this advancing vibe. Instead of cursing others, they need to be someone that blesses others. Obsessed with you. Talking about you non-stop won't give you a break. Won't give you a chance to live your life. You're living your life anyway. You, you, you. There are other people out there. They're not concerned about these other people. It has to be you. And that is why you must not feel small. You must not feel that you are inadequate. They will tell you that you are inadequate. They will tell you that you're not talented. You're nothing. You bring nothing to the table. You're not good enough. They will say that to you. That is what they are saying. But let me tell you something. If you were that they wouldn't have been at you like they are they wouldn't be so obsessed with you they wouldn't be talking about you they wouldn't be hating on you if you were truly what they say you are as the bird flies by if you were truly nothing they wouldn't be focused on you it is because you have something great to offer you're super talented Congratulations. Let them be obsessed when they think they are working against you. They are working against themselves. Oh my goodness. They realize that you won't bow to them. They were hoping that you would have put them on a pedestal, that you would have worshipped them. <laughs> They were hoping that you would have made them feel superior to you. Hmm? But you're not. All about you, 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 you. Studying you morning and night, minding your business non-stop, talking bad about you, hating on you. <laughs> Just because you're amazing. Just because you are great. But instead of it working against you, it works against them. You will continue to win nonetheless. You will continue to advance. That is what you do. The go-getter that you are. You are unstoppable. You are unbreakable. You are immovable. They cannot stop you. All you do is win. And every time they attack you, you get an even clearer mental image of what you want in life. Keep winning like the winner that you are. Keep advancing. As we hear on this Manchus channel, I am wearing my Manchus t-shirt that you can get one of. <laughs> the link will be somewhere in the description or it the t-shirt may appear somewhere on YouTube and there's other Manchus merch that you can get. 
and even those of the advancing channel as well as we are i'm just chilling with you in nature how about that and i am sending you good vibes i am sending you all of this love all of this light all of this positive energy i am here to remind you that everything is always working out for you that all you do is win despite what they say things are always working out for you great things are always coming your way i look forward to reading your comments as the birds sing i look forward to hearing what you have to say thank you for supporting the channel via paypal super thanks and so on you are valued you are appreciated my name is manchus this is the manchus channel <laughs> the sister channel to the advancing channel how about that where i Publish these advancing type videos. How about that? Inspirational, motivational, divine, spiritual. Manchester Casabo, one love, God bless, and all the best.